Previously on Swifty Travels, we stayed overnight in Durango, Colorado, drove the US 550 to Silverton for a fantastic lunch, and then drove up the spectacular Million Dollar Highway to Ure, Colorado. Okay, so there's like a traffic jam coming in here. It's super crowded for a Labor Day weekend, but this is Box Canyon Falls. And unfortunately, no dogs were allowed on the trail. No, we're going this way. So we didn't, uh, my husband's in the car with the dog and maybe he can come separately. Dogs are not allowed in this area due to sensitive wildlife. This area has hosted important research on the black swift, and no, we are not related. In the U.S., the black swifts are considered a species of conservation concern. In the United States, black swifts are a protected species under the Federal Migratory Bird Treaty Act of 1918. There's a colony that lives in Box Canyon and they typically arrive from Brazil in early June and stay through September. The city of Ure would like you to know that there are tons of hiking areas around Ure, and this is the only area where dogs are not allowed. Oh my goodness. So there's three trails here at Box Canyon. Hang on. There's the one that goes straight to the falls, which is the one I took with Geneva. Since we had to keep our dog in the car, we, I hiked it twice, because I wanted to go back and get my husband. It was pretty cool. So uh, there's also a bridge trail that goes way up high, way high above the canyon, but you can't see the falls from there. So we're not gonna do that today. 
but um, my husband and I are gonna take the nature trail back, which is supposed to be an easy loop back. I didn't do that with my daughter. She's in the car with the dog, eating and drinking some water. And I just want you to see how beautiful. sure I'm sunburnt. I'm not sure what I did with my sunblock today when we left the hotel. I put it on this morning and then I'm hoping it's in my suitcase but uh, with the elevation the sun is super direct so I recommend you don't lose your sunblock like I did and be prepared for some direct sun. This is the coolest place. I can't believe that just a few hours from Albuquerque and I've never made it here before. Mm -hmm. 